No. <laughs> mm. All right. But you know what's even better than boobs? A hard a good intro to the podcast. <laughs> Yo, what's oh. up? Welcome back to the uh, Average Conversations podcast. This is episode two. Whoa. I can't believe we made it this far. Anyway, um, if you didn't see episode one, that's, that was crazy. Luke said some crazy things about what he did as a kid. That Brady's was, not allowed in chi- uh, Japan. Yeah, I, I just like, legally can't go there anymore. <laughs> anymore, as if I've ever been there. But, what? Hey, it is what it is. Uh, I'm yeah. Luke. Oh, I'm Grady. Yeah, we've got to yeah. do introductions. Yeah, we gotta, uh, we got to work on that. We, we, uh, I, we don't do this know off we the dome. I do this off the dome. So We're just spitballing, maybe, man. Maybe we'll have a script next time. Maybe I'll just read off something so it sounds more smooth. But <laughs> um, just reading from my paper the whole time, just looking down. Just hello, how are you? <laughs> you gotta project. That's what they taught you how to do in uh, school when you did presentations. You gotta go project like all the time. Yeah, you gotta oh, like talk with your hands. You gotta. Oh yeah, yeah. That's like, uh, like the baby from that one movie. He's like, oh, from Meet the Fockers. You know that movie? He's like. I do actually a little bit. Um, <laughs> no, um, yeah. You talk about boobs a lot. He likes milk. Relatable. Wait. <laughs> I'm no, the I'm baby. The, for... the... No, no. <laughs> anyway, um, I actually, real quick, you mentioned Japan and how I'm not allowed to go, right? Yeah, Speaking... I'm allowed. Shut up. <laughs> okay. Anyway, and. <laughs> Speaking Japan. of other countries, let me just, I got to say something about Ireland real quick. Yeah. Well, it's not really, it's not about Ireland. It's just, I think when we go to Ireland, we should not, uh, we shouldn't get an Airbnb. We shouldn't get an Airbnb. What do you want to do? Just live on the streets? No, get a hotel. Handle? <laughs> just get a hotel. Yeah. Cause an Airbnb, I'm not, I'm not no pro on Airbnbs, right? I don't know. I heard mm-hmm. this from somewhere, and I think it's probably true. Maybe it's just some Airbnbs, but I what what I've been led to believe is that they, they put cameras in the toilets to see you poop. <laughs> <laughs> if if they put that on their Airbnb thing, then I'd hundred percent go. I mean, what? No, no. <laughs> I was making a joke. Okay, saying that would entice me more to go, but it was a joke. But anyway, no. Don't wink at me. <laughs> no, I think Airbnbs. When you uh, when you leave, you have to clean the house. Yeah, but I'm not trying to do my literal job on vacation. <laughs> do you feel me? Okay. Well, I. I, I mean, how much are, how much are we gonna be? I feel like it doesn't really matter about the cleaning thing because how often are we going to be in the Airbnb or hotel? Like, as little as possible. I guess. You know? That's, yeah. Like, literally just to sleep. It doesn't matter that much. Like, I'll clean it. But, like, it's just some, like, just like a, like a thing you just have to remember to do at the end. And if... Yeah. I guess... You don't, they, like, give you a fee. Yeah, if you do, like, not a good job. If you, like, don't clean it well, yeah, you have to, like, pay extra. But this is really not that big of a... Yeah, we're not yeah, going to be pretty... doing that much, but... I'm impartial either way. Like, yeah, hotel, Airbnb. Oh, yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't care. really care. I mean, yeah. I'd rather do an Airbnb because it's like, you know, it's more it's, of a, it's a house, but. Yeah. Or a castle. <laughs> I mean, we got them all. No, we don't. <laughs> we can stay in a bus. I saw a bus one on, on Ireland Airbnb. That'd be kind of crazy. It's we like should a actually... double decker bus that's just parked there. <laughs> we need to actually start to plan it out a bit more. I was going to go to at this point. AAA. Like AAA, yeah, they help you with, like traveling and stuff. I think they convert your money for you and stuff, or maybe a bank does that. But they okay. they they do like packages. That's what my mom did when she went to Rome, London. She went to like six European countries on one like trip, and mm. um, when like a hundred years ago, because our parents are old. Yeah, actually, not that far off. But <laughs> man, I'm cracking them today, huh? <laughs> Over or under 50 years ago. <laughs> no, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking about it. Um, no, they went to, uh, they went with like a group, which I don't yeah. really like the I don't want to do of. that. Yeah, I just yeah, want to be able like to it. do whatever, whenever. 
but they they plan things you can you can go with, you can do like the full on like go with a group they plan everything out you have to just go with them and stuff there is time hmm. there my mom said there is time when or time to like do your own thing like you're not always with the group but the triple a apparently can also like um you they just plan or they just tell you i guess where to go they like prepay for your tickets for bus like transportation and stuff yeah but like do we yeah i guess it doesn't i I don't i don't think it would be that hard to figure all that out ourselves i agree but i feel like we should just do it ourselves okay yeah we we still don't know who's coming though (laughs) me and you if we're going in may colby's not going yeah and my friends are in school in may so bada bing bada boom it's me and you baby and that'll make it cheaper for a hotel or not i guess it wouldn't matter for a hotel or something because our airbnb would be cheaper depending on how many people you're saying so maybe that is the way to go airbnb this is true um yeah that's what i wanted to say about ireland though ireland's gonna be so crazy i know there's gonna be people with bagpipes is that (laughs) ireland i don't really know but i hope there is (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> oh shit <laughs> did you see that flash he went crazy it started laughing it's like <laughs> <laughs> yeah no nah, ireland's gonna be cool we're gonna like take like right along the southern coast southern okay what's down there i think it's just very pretty i've Moher heard cliffs yeah Moher. i want to see that the connemara that's like what are you a, saying right it's now? a it's a mountain range. Oh, like the Alps. Very, not as big. <laughs> Probably not as big or as pretty as the Alps, I'm assuming, but is the Alps pretty? I would I say know. so. I've never been. I've seen live... some pictures, they look nice. You live by a bunch of mountains, right? And they're very pretty. So yeah. The Alps must be pretty pretty too. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. I don't know much about the Alps, but no, they're bigger and like more, um, rocky. I guess I don't know. Like the, Alps? the what about the Rocky Mountains? Are those those the are also bigger. Yeah, the, no, they look pretty cool. Like the biggest mountain here is like an average mountain out west, northeast, south west. Oh, that way. Yeah, I have to do that every time. I, every time rocky I hear mountain. like. Every time I hear east or west, I have to like imagine a compass in front of me so I know which way is huh? which, and then I, <laughs> um, because I don't know the difference. I I don't know. I just know north and south. Up and down. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the, west the y left. axis, if you will. Um, <laughs> <laughs> the uh, what are the latitude and longitude? Oh shoot, dude. <laughs> coordinates. Fifty-eight <laughs> degrees. Can you go up in coordinates? Is that a thing? Or is it what just do you mean? on land? Can you go up coordinates too? Like if you want to find the coordinates of a top of a mountain, you get where it is on oh, land, but then oh, up. Yeah, yeah, X, Y, and Z axis, I think is what it is. But but is coordinates all those three combined? Like is that, does coordinates already... If you need to go that compass? far. Oh. Yeah, I think that's altitude. Oh, altitude, yeah, 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 okay. Right, like that's, but then like, what if it go, would it just be like negative if you're going like to the... Below sea level. Below sea level, yeah. I guess so. I don't I, know. It's it's confusing. When I look at coordinates, it's confusing. It's just numbers, decimals. Uh, numbers are tough for me. Num- <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, numbers are tough. It's kind of crazy to think about, like, old people, like, like the explorers and stuff. They just, like, look at the stars and know where to go. Yeah, but it's because... And then they figured it out. <laughs> it's because they're old and smarter and they actually had to do things for themselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah. use our resources, though. Like, I guess. Like, old people are always like, these whippersnappers have everything on their phone. And it's like, yeah, you invented the phone. Anyway, and we're Haters. using it. Haters, man. Yeah. They always complain, but they're generate. Well, at least my dad's gener- like, my dad's like, video games. Yeah, that's a whole. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> What happened? Choked on it for a second. Oh, choking on coffee. What the heck? Choking on coffee. Co- coffee. Oh my gosh, yeah. you're just speaking New York accents in Ireland. 
they would <laughs> just talk in bad like American accents, like Southern or Brooklyn Southern. accents. Yeah, and they wouldn't be able to tell like that we're doing a bad bad accent because like, you know, <laughs> like if someone like pretended to be British and like they're like talking in a British accent the whole time, <laughs> I wouldn't call them out on it at all. I just believe them. We should we should speak in an Irish accent and see how long it takes someone to call us out. <laughs> just be like. Yeah, we're Irish, and then and then someone. Hello. Like, <laughs> yeah. enough. I, I don't know. I don't know. I double fist and potatoes. They wouldn't know the difference. Wait, can <laughs> Bro, that's you ever you Irish. Ever, um, you ever think about things in the shower? <laughs> uh, no. Nah, I listen to music really loud, and I drink beer in the shower. <laughs> Guinness, whole garden. <laughs> Oh garden, yeah. Oh garden. I've been drinking um, Modelo. I I don't know. I it's don't beer, know. man. Yeah, but like, what? What's special about it? Like, I'm just beer. saying that's what I've been wheat drinking beer. in the shower. <laughs> Is it wheat beer like Ho Garden? Yeah. <laughs> nah, so Ho Garden's a Belgian beer yeah. from Belgium. Modelo's from Mexico. That Mexican beer, huh? They do things yeah. differently down there. I heard. <laughs> yeah, i don't know but <laughs> yeah cultures and stuff but uh i got a few shower thoughts lined up here all Hit right me with them. <clears throat> okay <laughs> so first one think about this bro tall people are expected to use their reach to help shorter people but if a tall person were to ask a short person to hand them something they dropped on the floor it would be insulting <laughs> yeah i that's not as good of one as the other ones but <laughs> okay i was yeah i was still trying to like comprehend it because uh, you know i'm dumb and stuff so like i was trying like, to comprehend yeah like if they're like oh i accidentally dropped that pen can you pick it up for me short stuff yeah do you see that it, my it was purple this is turn purple yeah <laughs> it's purple for a second what the like, i'm looking at your screen right now but i can still see myself out the corner of my yeah. eye and like i just saw that turn purple i'm like the hulk the hulk because he has it's purple, purple, purple oh, shorts. Purple shorts. Yeah, how does yeah. his shorts stay on when he gets big like that? And why are they always purple? I don't know. I've been reading like Hulk comics lately. Okay. Hulk's a cool guy. Yeah. I like the Hulk. Like he what does you... like I read like what is it? Planet Hulk or whatever. Okay. And like I don't okay. know. I don't <laughs> no, know about co it's... like the comics and stuff. No, Hulk's cool. I always thought Hulk was like mid. Hulk's not mid. What do you mean? He's like, he's like as cool as Spider-Man. No, I'm he's not saying like strong, like as interesting. Like as interesting. Like the, he's like as hip as him. No, Spider-Man's like my favorite favorite hero, you know? But he's not like in the Marvel? strongest. Yeah, he's my favorite hero. Okay. My favorite character in that. But then like the Hulk is like right here now. He used to be like way down here. But now he's like What's he doing down there? <laughs> Spider-Man is not He's he can he can hold his own. Yeah, but for real. like in the grand scheme of things, though. Oh Hulk's, yeah, like Doctor like, Strange will mess that guy up. Yeah, exactly. Doctor, I like, don't know why everyone says Captain Marvel is the strongest Avenger. Or strongest, like he messes like, with like space and time. Like yeah, yeah. Doctor Strange. Once you get to that stuff, that's where everyone. you're like, yeah. He can send people to different dimensions, like bro. Right. Yeah. But then Spider Man did actually beat Doctor Strange for like. Yeah, with maths. <laughs> Quick maths. <laughs> what do you say this is just like geometry class or whatever yeah and he starts talking about dividing by pi <laughs> nerd how do you divide by pi it's an infinite number what the heck yeah the foot well anyway i guess his brain is just way too big for that yeah i don't get it way too big for also, mine, i mean what am i talking? i also bought an actual spider-man comic that's coming in soon for how like an old one no it's like oh. a big book of like a complete series oh it's like a thousand pages so I'm excited. Gonna, you're gonna read the whole thing. Wait, it's just it. like boxes, right? It's not like a it's yeah, it's a comic, comic book. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. it's not like it'll take that long. It's not a book. I mean, thousand yeah. pages is a lot, but like but yeah, I think about it. There's like max like twenty <laughs> words on a page or whatever. You know, it's just like more like <laughs> that would take you... me like ten minutes. <laughs> exactly. So like, I'm a little worried about that because it did cost like almost. It was on sale. It was only seventy dollars, where it's like usually a hundred dollars for the book. To me, that's fine. Seventy bucks I... for a whole spider-man comic that's sounds like a good deal to me yeah to me that seems fine 
Perfect. Real, bu real quick, someone, though. Someone ringing you right now? You can hear that? <laughs> yeah, on the landline. <laughs> oh, my, my thing wasn't lighting up, so I thought it, it couldn't hear you couldn't hear it, but that'll be fine. But no, no, real quick, I just want to tell you that uh, theme parks can get a, a clear picture of you on a roller coaster going like 70 miles an hour, but like mm -hmm. bank cameras are just can't get a clear picture of a person standing there. This is true. Do you How think that's is like that? a... <laughs> Is that just like for like movie purposes and stuff to make it more intense? No, I'm just saying in real life. Is that a like real CCTV life thing? CCTV is like terrible. Maybe they're probably better now, but like I've yeah. never, I've never uh, imagined <laughs> security footage being that good, as good as a roller coaster picture. That, that's true, because like Even they got to budget their money better. Like just buy like some old cameras from a theme park, and they're doing good. You know? Yeah, yeah, like. Even if the co camera quality of security, like bank security cameras, is good now, yeah. like I don't. I Fifteen years ago, still imagine not that great. Like if I went to like a theme park like fifteen years ago, and I'm like, how old would I be? Like seven. Like they got great pictures of me going down that. Yeah. That water slide, or whatever yeah, it was. Exactly. Like, yeah. It's like it's like banks want people to steal from them. <laughs> I dare you. <laughs> <laughs> I dare you. <laughs> oh, man. I was actually uh, thinking about how I could rob a bank today. Do you want to hear my plan? No, yep. just... Yeah, okay. So, um... If it's a good plan, I'm cutting this all out and we'll, we'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So there's a construction on one road in my town, right? Okay. So, like, do you know, like, the geography of my town, kind of? Like, there's the big main strip. <clears throat> You know, with like McDonald's and all that, Taco remember, Bell. Remember we went to the uh, ice cream place like that one time when you first moved into the house you're in right now? It was, it was me and my parents. The ice There's cream an ice place? cream place. There's a subway near it, I think. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I know that part. I don't know. Oh. But I, no, I also know the main strip where like. McDonald's? I think so. And like there's an Olympia Sports. Yeah, so, so like there's. A... I know those two parts. I don't know how they connect, or I don't know like how they. Okay, go so together, that's but I know just those one big. Parts. That's just one big straight road. All oh, right, it's the same road. Yep. Okay. I just, yep. Olympia I just didn't Sports. That, but... Olympia Sports ice cream place subway. Five minutes down the road from each other. Okay. I can imagine. Straight there. road, and then you take a left. From like Olympia or not Olymp? Sorry, from subway. Subway. There's okay. a there's a second road, and that's like. The second big road, kind of, like, where people drive to get to point A, point B. It's convenient. There's less uh -huh. traffic. But there's construction on that B road right now. Okay. It's like, my plan would be to cause some kind of confusion on the main strip on the A road. Okay. So then they'd have to drive through the construction. Okay. To get to the bank. And that would leave me enough time to get away. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> So where's the part? Where's the part where you robbed the bank? <laughs> I just walk in like disguise. I got my gun. And I'm like, give me the money. And they're like, oh my god, okay. <laughs> give me the money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then I didn't but really then, think about it that hard. But I mean, yeah, you need a, distractions. A good one. I mean, right? Like, there's like some roadblock at mcdonald's or something so they can't get by there i'm like oh no now we have to go down this dirt road now because it's a yeah. dirt road right now is the other road yeah and like they're building a bunch of roundabouts so like what are they gonna do drive they just have to drive really slow around the roundabouts Ooh. and that takes a long Wait, time to do do you are you saying like it'll push the cops down that road too it'll down force the, them the to slow... go yeah it'll force them to go down the slow road now we're talking i see what you're talking about now <laughs> yeah okay. right right it's a good idea but but you just you just run away on foot with the money, <laughs> or you get in your car. I, I and you, you go on the slow road too. They'll never <laughs> see it coming. Go back the other way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just, <I> mean, boom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you go you go on the slow road too. They'll never see it coming because you're gonna try. If you're realistically robbing a bank, you'd want to go get away as fast as possible. Uh -huh. They'll never suspect it. Or while I'm driving, I have, like, people doing the roadblock. I'm like, okay, clear out the roadblock now. And they're like, all right, boss. <laughs> they clear it out. <laughs> like the Italian job. You probably haven't seen that movie. 
It's insane. Is that, is that an old movie? Yeah. It sounds probably old. came out in like 2003 or something. Damn, it's crazy that that's old. Me. <laughs> I was born Were you born in 2003? Yeah. Yeah. It might have been earlier. It might have been like 2000. I don't know. They had laptops already, so. Shit. And flip bones. <laughs> High tech, man. <laughs> um, I kind of wish that, like, it's, like, legal for everyone to, like, rob a bank one time in their life and just, like, have it be, like, a you get away with it. Like, it, if you get caught, they're like, all right, fair enough. Like, everyone wants to rob a bank once, you know? You know Wait, you said you think it should be legal to try and rob a bank be you, yeah just do it one time per person like if you don't kill anyone you, you know get the money and, and run. yeah you just get the money and run you get away with it great you get to keep the money and you keep it okay and then if you get caught they're like give the money back and then we're cool unless you kill someone okay yeah if, if right? it's a, a victim full crime yes it's a victim full crime a vi you, is that the word Victim full, victim less. Full. No, well, yeah, I mean, but victim full sounds weird. Never said that in my life. <laughs> New word. <laughs> Put that in the dictionary. <laughs> I'm calling up Webster right now. <laughs> Let um, me email them. You know what that made me think of? Is like, I I wish it was legal. Well, I guess it is legal. <laughs> but I wish it was okay for a a person, like a cash register person or someone to like, yell at a customer like once every like six months or something six months it should be like once a, a week year, man a week yeah okay <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah that's what i'm saying but like i, I would just try to be fair like yesterday at work dude i want i would want to yell at so many people oh my i have so at the restaurant i work at we have three desserts right three okay. brownie sundae cookie pie sundae and an ice cream <laughs> cake all right okay. yeah pretty simple yeah it's in fact it's very simple very right this lady made me make stuff recite, up. no this lady made me recite the three desserts four times <laughs> i didn't explain what a brownie sundae was like yep it's a brownie has ice cream on it whipped cream hot fudge she's like okay what was the next one cookie pie sundae it's a cookie with ice cream whipped cream hot fudge okay what's the next one it's an ice cream cake coffee ice cream with an oreo crust it's like okay what was the first one again <laughs> <laughs> okay, can you just read all of them again? Four times in a row. What the heck? Like, I should be able to just walk away and be like, okay, you guys are all done. Like, it's time for you guys to leave. How old was this person? 50. Okay, so she shouldn't be forgetting stuff that easy, realistically? Like, probably not. Like, it happens so often, and then, um. Well, maybe it's just hard to remember. The three desserts, a brownie I, I don't remember them right now, though. But you're not, like, trying to get them, though. You're, like, in the story and set. Like, you know? Okay. Like, if you're at yeah, a I restaurant, guess. you think, you yeah. know? Mm -hmm. And then, like, it's so frustrating. Like, the other week, there was these two couples sitting at the same table. Okay. And um, there's this one couple that's just asking the stupidest questions. And I'm like, yeah. are you... And this other couple is like, you can come back in a minute if you want. Because, they, like, they realize, like... I'm really busy, and, like, they're, like, making me stand there for five minutes, and five minutes is a lot of time. Yeah. Like, they're like, can you explain this item on, what's, uh, this sauce? What does this taste like? Is this spicy? Right. They made me answer all these questions that are, like, you know, I'm busy, um, so they're like, you can come back. But the thing about that is, like, they, the woman that just kept asking you about the desserts, like, she just uh -huh. kept asking about them, but these people are asking what things are, right? Like they didn't maybe. ask multiple times. Like it's that seems a bit more better than like the one that just keeps like asking. those. I made them sound a lot more like reasonable questions than they really were. Like they're, I don't remember exactly because it was a week ago. I just remember they were really bad questions and like you could see like the other couple like giving them like dirty looks. Like, are it's you guys serious? That's yeah, but they're also like old, like fifty years old. So okay, whatever you want to call it, double date. Sure, old people can't go on Get a double together. date. Yeah, it's a get together at that point. Yeah, Double dates for like people, high schoolers people or something. Be. No, they can't. It's illegal. It's just so awkward <laughs> to me. <laughs> That's gross. Old people having sex. Oh. <laughs> oh man. 
I wish I could remember some of this stuff because I don't work in a place now that I have to deal with people that much. Like actually talk to people. Uh huh. Oh my gosh, my coworker from my last job who peed herself all the time. I can talk about that, dude. It was so bad. She would she would pee, she would have to leave early, like work early sometimes to just go home and like change. She'd come back because she Ugh. peed herself. This happened on like three occasions, right? I'm going to give you the rundown, okay? The yeah. first three days that she had to work there, the first day that or she got hired, and then my boss wanted her to come in on the following Monday. So mm-hmm. she shows up. She's in the kitchen. She goes in the kitchen, and she, there's a little a nook with, like, shelves on it, and that's where we keep, like, food, just, like, cans of food. If yeah. We, just stuff, like, flour, just, like, stuff. Yeah. In that nook, though, there's a step down to get to it, and she didn't know okay. that. She just... She just tried walking into like the nook just fell down hurt herself and then she had to leave oh my god because she 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 hurt herself which is like fine because no one told you that it's just yeah it's there's there's just a random step here you wouldn't expect it unless you yikes like you wouldn't so that's so she had to leave first day your boss is lucky she didn't get like really hurt and stuff yeah i know (laughs) so five minutes she was there on the first day for five minutes had to leave Second day, for five minutes. Like, is that an exaggeration? Like, would you say five? I wasn't minutes? there. Oh, okay. I heard right. five minutes. Yeah, uh, bro. What? Even if I multiply it by four, twenty minutes. She's there at work for twenty minutes. Like, she's there for a short time. You know, yeah. like yeah, just a really short time. Had mm-hmm. to leave. Um. So the second day is the first time she peed herself. The second day she comes back. Yeah. She, she pe- was probably <sighs> there for. She was probably there for like a little while longer, like a few hours probably. <laughs> Had to leave, okay? Take a bathroom break. Third day. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Third <laughs> You third feel like you pee. Go to the toilet and take a pee. Third day, she can't get her oh. bra on in the morning. Third day, she couldn't get her bra on? Yeah, I, I don't... What? Okay. So, just like, you've seen her. You talked to her. I did. She's didn't... The oh, one that was her. Okay. Yeah. She, she yeah. talked about her Jeep with you. I heard that story so many times. Oh, my God. I don't even every, remember the story that she every told Every customer me. that came in, she's trying to buy a new Jeep, and she had 22 oh. cents less money in her account to afford the Jeep so the bank wouldn't cut the check for her. Mm-hmm. And then she told every customer that came in that story. She's like, I'm trying to get a Jeep, but I had I'm, I'm, I don't have 22 cents. So they didn't let me get it or didn't give me the check or whatever. So yeah, that's what she told you. Uh-huh. But yeah, she couldn't get her bra on. I don't really. I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about that. If I was a chick and I had to wear bras, I'm wearing sports bras all day. Yeah, I guess they look I a lot more comfy. I think. Yeah. And a lot easier than doing the back thing. Taking a bra off is hard, man. Yeah. I would assume. Sounds, yeah. I've never had sex. <laughs> you. <laughs> I, I guess I don't really know, but that that's just the that's just the the three day the first three days that she ever had to work there. Talk about some job security. She's keeping that job still after those three days. Yep. Damn. She she walked out after a while though and quit. That's how she quit. She just left. Nice. Got, oh my god, she had so many problems like with just cooking the food because she she had to like make food and stuff. Mm-hmm. It was bad. She like, like every now and then, whoever's the cook on that day, like if they like ruin food, like if they burn food, it's like fine. She had okay. to, my boss had to have her keep track on a piece of paper how much she burnt because she did it so much that it was like costing way too much money. Yeah. Yeah. Holy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's like, it, it, it was really bad. It was probably like, several like maybe up to three or four pizzas a day what yeah that's ridiculous so like... <laughs> yeah wow that's what i'm saying um which is pizzas actually everything at that store that i worked at was pretty expensive pizzas were not that expensive but it's sure. still like it's like 15 dollars or 16 dollars why does she not does she have a timer for the pizzas she had to have a timer after a while why would you not? Why do you guys just not have timers to begin with? Um, I don't know, cause everybody else that I guess cooked food would just check, like, just 
open up the no ocean when. and look at it. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, not even just no when. They just open up the oven and just look at it and then see how far along it is. So you just keep doing that until it's ready. But she just yeah. would just do something and then get distracted and then just like walk away. And it huh. takes maybe, f it's like maybe 15 minutes to like yeah. put the thing through. She'd leave it for like 25 minutes. What a lady. Yeah. Peter pants at work three times. Yeah. Thrice. Yeah. <laughs> Thrice. <laughs> Thrice. It's. You just gotta wear a diaper. <laughs> Maybe. They make those. She, um... No she... bra, not just a diaper. Dude, it... This might be the worst thing, actually. Wow. I don't know. But she used to, like, bake a lot of stuff, like... Did she leave a puddle like... when she peed? No. I, I don't know. I was never there for any of those times. Oh, okay. I just heard about it from other people. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry, she's baking, you said? Yeah, she likes just baking stuff like brownies or like just like cookies, just like baking stuff. And she uh -huh. bring, she would just sometimes just bring stuff to work for people to have, which was nice. This one batch of brownies she made, she, she smoked, right? She's like, she's a smoker. You could taste the cigarette smoke in the brownies. Like, that's, bad. That's that home cooking that people love <laughs> i know it's like it was so bad cigarette smoke cigarette the... i was trying to think of a name mar <laughs> what's like a marl brownie <laughs> marl brownies uh, or, uh, what's a newport brownie Bra yeah i was trying to think of like some port. like alliteration or something yeah brownie port or something <laughs> right i know so much more about cigarettes than i need to because i sold them <laughs> at the store um, nice did you start smoking them too just to sell them better to people like oh this one's real smooth <laughs> <laughs> no they can tell if it's smooth it says on the carton uh, did you know that too smooth cut or something I don't know what smooth means no like um <clears throat> what were some questions people asked about cigarettes oh people would just be like they just come in holding like money and they'd be like what's the cheapest ones you got Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, like, okay. They didn't. They wouldn't just ask about cigarettes. It's not like beer, where like yeah, people, people ask like questions oh, about people, that kind of people stuff. People did ask about beer. Yeah. Uh, I can't remember what. Just like what's. Uh, I don't know. They asked about like IPAs and stuff, mm -hmm. or like that. Like, I don't. Is it IPA that's like the the beer that comes in like a four pack and it's really expensive? Those are usually like the imported or like the micro brew. Yeah, micro brew, like the expensive yeah. stuff. They always ask, like, "What's the best one?" I'm like, "Dog, I'm like 18. I don't, I don't know." Yeah, but I just tell them the most popular ones. Which is the most G -string. popular? G string. G string. Hey yo. My dad, uh, my dad drinks it. It's from Funky Bo. Oh wait, where's Funky, Funky Bo? Funky down the street from me, actually. Yeah, I was it's gonna crazy. say that sounds familiar. It's like so, <clears throat> you know, you know where Dollar General is near my house. That yeah, I remember. Like, I, I remember your dad saying that like, we gotta go to the funky bow that's the cool new hip spot that's like if you went to if you go to my house you'd go past funky bow yeah my way right home near the dollar General. yeah mm -hmm. it's like a it's like a dirt it's road past the lights uphill. yeah yeah it's past the lights. i know straight through. i know exactly where it is yeah i've been there they have uh pizza we'll have to go sometime to the funky bow it's expensive oh i my dad said he he's like i wish i could go to funky bow but it's six dollars a beer so that's how much beer costs it. nowadays yeah but you can get a yeah i mean it's i guess it's good but like you can just get bud light six for six <laughs> so you, you can get the same amount but six cans or same amount of money for but six cans yeah six dollars for one glass though at funky bow I, it was a while ago i don't remember what how big like they serve it but yeah, I don't know. That's oh, drinking the Fiji water on that bougie water. What is the best water? This? No. Should we make a water tier list right now? Not right now because we don't have them. But like, oh, like an in-person one. Like, yeah. I want to try like Icelandic water. Icelandic water. It's like What's it's the... like the same shape. Is that a brand? This. Yeah. It's, it's like called Icelandic. Icelandic. I think so. Like, what would we have to get? We'd have to get, like, what's the new, like, one in the... What's the metal water or whatever? The one in the can? 
Oh, I don't know. Canned water. The can no, like uh Cody Cole always talks about it. I don't really I don't know. I've had Something's canned going water on with your audio like... right now. Is it? Like not right now, but like there just was just something. Let's keep on going. If it happens again, I'll mention it. All right. My audio, yeah, okay. So like it's like metal, like it's a it's in an aluminum can, like a beer. Yeah. It's called like something. It's like something like kind of like it's like death water or something or death liquid. Liquid death. I don't liquid know. death. Yeah. No, that's it. I thought that was a beer. No, it's, it's a water. water. Yeah. What? Why is it called liquid death? Why would someone drink that? <laughs> water called liquid I, death. What? I, I don't know. I I'll try it or I try it. If it's... Yeah, we'll have that in it. Fiji, Evian. Yeah. Evian, dude. What's like the worst water you ever had? Besides like tap water, like an actual brand. Nestle. <laughs> is that the Walmart brand? Yeah. Or is that? <laughs> I think so. You ever had Crystal Geyser? No. Sounds good. Oh, it's like straight like salt water. Mm. Like I could almost taste like salt in the water. My bum That's just the minerals are putting it. It tastes so bad though. Uh. I'd rather drink the good stuff. I have Dasani <laughs> in my in my fridge too. That's the one we have to try. I like uh, Poland There's Springs. So many Poland Springs apparently isn't that like pure. What? Uh, like it's apparently not that good i guess but like i think it's fine taste wise i don't from maine gotta represent yeah <laughs> aquafina <laughs> water tier list we have to put that in yeah ideas yeah 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 we've been going for 37 minutes already <laughs> we haven't even gotten into our topics we just been spitballing Ooh. so what do we do do we keep going why not we're cranking right now. All right. You know a show I saw on, the, on TV the other day that I haven't seen in a while? Huh. The Walking Dead. On AMC? Used, yeah, it was when I was at Uncle Russ's house. Oh, yeah, you slept over there. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah when I came back from the airport. But, yeah. like, I was surprised. I was like, oh, that, that show's still going on. And it had me yeah. thinking. What would nine I do there. during the nine seasons? Is it still <laughs> going? No, no. They're just oh, rerunning it. But it went for nine seasons, oh, I think. No, but, I stopped watching after like the fourth season, but it had me thinking, what would I do in the zombie apocalypse? Okay. So I'd like to start with you. What would you do in a zombie apocalypse? Well, me personally. Um I would okay, so I'm assuming let's assume like okay, I just wake up, okay? Like can we assume I, I wake up and there's zombies. Like okay. I go to sleep, it's nighttime, and I wake up zombies. So I'm at my house. Got and it. are they are they like the normal <laughs> zombies, like the Walking Dead type zombies, or are they like running around crazy type? No, people? Walking Dead. Walking Dead. Okay. This ain't the Running Dead, bro. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> man. Okay. Um, nah. So what I do is instantly gear gear up. Are my parents still alive? <laughs> we'll say. We'll I'll say yeah. You, I'll, I'm gonna okay. say everyone in my house is alive, and I assume like everyone else is a zombie. Every okay. Well, kind of for for okay. now. But okay, so we gear up instantly in a zombie apocalypse. You got to get good, like a good stock of food. Okay. Mm -hmm. So what I do is because I live in like the middle of the woods, there isn't like really there isn't a lot of houses around me as yeah. much as other places. New York City, you're screwed instantly. Mm -hmm. There's just zombies everywhere. But I don't live in a place where there's that many houses. Like so, what I do is we'd get. I, I was struggling to figure this out today, but I think I would get the tr my dad's truck, even though okay. it's loud because it's a vehicle. Just go down my road both ways and just break into the houses and take all the food. Just chuck okay. it in the back of my dad's truck. Just imagine how much food that is. Like, there is a good amount of houses on my road, but it's not dense, you know? Sure. So if you, there's a lot of woods in between the houses. Mm -hmm. So you can, like, there's like a lot of distance. So if there's zombies somewhere, you can either kill it or you can just get away real easily because there's a sure. lot of air you can go. So we, I'd get all as much food as we can, just break into the houses, chuck chuck the food in the back of the truck, huh? and, then, and then just come back, and then we have food, okay? All right. So then... You're staying at your house? Yeah. Okay. In the middle of the woods, I mean, 
Yeah. I don't, All right, keep I don't, going. I don't know if zombies. Anyway, <laughs> um, what were they gonna say? Oh, because in a lot of zombie movies, the uh, for some reason the power goes out like instantly. The power is yeah. still gonna be running for a while. Okay. Mm-hmm. So I'd try to uh, get a whole like. I just try to f- see who's alive. On just Twitter, snap, just go through snap. No, 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 Snapchat. No, like who I know, <laughs> who ain't turned what? yet. <laughs> no, no, just the people that I know. Like on like Snapchat, just be like, "You good?" And then, and if they reply, then we'd be like, "Yo, come to my house." Let's and then, link. And then we <laughs> link up in the zombie apocalypse. But yeah, yeah. and I just try to find, and then we just get as many people, mm-hmm. hopefully, and and then we're we're good in that like. You know, more people is better in zombie apocalypse. Well, sure. Is it? I guess so. Um, These are the questions then, you'd have to think of. Then, once we figure that out, you got to figure out um, a good, better way of transportation. You can't just be, keep driving the truck around, right? Well, you're going to like find a horse? A Tesla. Them's <laughs> is quiet. <laughs> <laughs> well, like. No, find, that's not. You don't put a. Uh, you gonna put a solar panel on it so it's just infinite energy? Oh my, yeah. I was thinking today about it. I was like, what if I get a gasoline generator to charge it up? You just gotta keep finding gas though. But uh, but yeah, solar panel. You know, the gasoline generator is pretty loud. Yeah, but you put it at my house in the middle of the woods. Then they're gonna hear it. How can zombies hear that far? I feel like they can't hear that far. I mean, they can hear as far as like it makes noise. That makes sense, you know? Like, yeah. Assume they have normal people hearing. Yeah, solar panel. But I would, okay. But I wasn't going that way with it. I would try to find a Tesla, though. I, I would want to whip one of those around in zombie apocalypse. Anyway, huh? um, no. I was thinking a better, like, find a really fast car and then Mad Max the crap out of it. Take put all the cow, doors off. Put a cow catcher everything. on it. <laughs> oh my god i might as throw well. the heavy throw the heavy duty wheels on it <laughs> find a repair torch you're good to go <laughs> oh my gosh just all five of my slots repair torch it no i'm driving my dad has the repair torches we're just running through stuff and he's just repairing it as we go <laughs> sticking out the window <laughs> <laughs> no you you mad max it so you can so we take all the doors off right and not okay. only does that make the car lighter which means it's better on gas but also okay. makes it faster uh-huh. because it's lighter. No, he got so, like a like a proper dune buggy, bro. Damn! It, it, it just better in a zombie apocalypse. I feel like taking the doors off though. That means you have less protection from them. Yeah, but you can get away easier. You just speed right through. Okay. I, I I don't know. I mean, yeah, you're right. But like, maybe maybe you can put some sort of really light like thing in place of a door like a lighter version of a door i feel like you don't need to go that fast to get away from a zombie though I like my thought is that. like you get like a bulldozer like one of those big ones with the big wheels yeah yeah yeah. you just drive real slow around you just like get like that thing go up and down just steamroller you run them all over but, yeah but the gas don't those things probably guzzle gas you have to every time oh, you that's... have to go and you have to just... If you think a F-350 is a gas guzzler, <laughs> just wait until you get a bulldozer. Yeah, F-350 is a real gas guzzler, but bulldozer... You, you just have to keep going and, like, getting gas out of cars. Because eventually, you can't get gas from the from the gas station. The power is yeah. going to shut off after however long that takes, and then mm-hmm. you're screwed. No more gas. You got to get them out of the cars. Also, imagine, like... <laughs> imagine you go to the gas station in a zombie apocalypse, and the the power is still on. You put your debit card in. You got to pay for the gas to actually get it still. <laughs> oh, man. Insufficient funds. I mean, <laughs> man. You just find, you just, again. Would money, how would you even rebuild like the economy after that? I think you're thinking too far ahead. Yeah. But I think you just got to think about, that. you just got to think about getting through the day at that point. Right? Yeah, but I feel like if if we base up if we get a bunch of food, like from the beginning, get as much mm-hmm. food as possible, and an easy way to transport it is my dad's truck. You just chuck it in the back. Yeah. And then 
whatever, get back to my house. I feel like my house is in a very good spot. In terms okay. of, like, I feel like, because there's not, the, the, the closest houses are, like, down the, down the dirt road, which are, they're close, but, like, I, I'm not, it's not dense, you know? Like, there's a lot of space. Sure. I don't want so i feel like if we just have enough food and enough water we have to collect water though because eventually this creek won't work but well i have a well yep you got that creek next to you oh look at these fucking pit stains i got going on right now <laughs> what the heck what? <laughs> you got but, the creek too yeah right next creek. to your yeah, house yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. just but, boil that shit there's also the pond near my house, down the street. That's down okay. the street, though. You know if you go out of the dirt road? You know what I'm talking about? No. Go out of the dirt road, go left, and there's that oh, really sharp Oh, it's not turn. down your street. It's like on your street, not on your road. Yeah, on the, uh, I know on the road, about. the coal road. Like, I don't yeah, know, not... there's two roads I live on. I don't know, bro. I know what you're saying, though. <laughs> but, yeah, that there's also that. But I feel like if we have food and water, my house is pretty good to be at. Like, we're set. Like, I think we wouldn't have to worry that much about... You just have to worry about the the wandering zombies. The ones that happen to just wander, like, down the driveway or something. But there there isn't just going to be a t- crap ton of zombies around my house just at any given oh. moment. Like, I wouldn't worry about getting through the night in my house. What about season two in The Walking Dead? Where all those zombies pull up? How they do that? How they, how they pull up, though? Like someone had to lure them there, right? I don't, I don't, I don't remember. I don't, I don't. I mean, you remember Project Zomboid? We had a great spot at that tire shop. You're right. <laughs> that yeah, shit but you just don't. Pan. But you just don't get a. You just don't get a, a person that would lure zombies to your house. You get, you get the real ones. <laughs> so what you saying? <laughs> What? <laughs> you know what I would do? I would check to make sure you're still alive. I what would you it. do? What would you do? Would you stay in your house? <clears throat> no. Would you come to my house? Uh, think about it. Probably I got another not. computer here. We can play Fortnite. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I got another computer. <laughs> nah, so there's a, there's a storage unit place next to where I live. Ooh, it's okay. all fenced up, all fenced around. Okay. Right. Now we're talking. Okay. And then there's got to be a blicky or two in those storage units, you know? <laughs> so then I get I, the blicky. I feel, like a, I feel like a gun isn't a good thing to have, though. It's loud. It's a good last resort, though. Like, you need it. You got it. If you're going maybe, out, maybe, you want to go shooting. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> um, So, yeah, I do that. It's right next to the river. Um, Water. What do you do about food? Same thing that you do, you know. Just find a way to just store a bunch of it and just yeah, get as much as you can at a time and bring it back. Yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. And then eventually, like, where would I? There's a logging like place right there. That's like a big open field. Start to farm eventually. Oh. Yeah. Growing some corn. Yeah, Shabbat. In New Hampshire. <laughs> yeah. Corn and. In- Wait, how long did it take for corn to grow? Yeah, but winter. Oh my gosh, my cheeks are so... Ru- Holy crap. L- you you a little embarrassed right now? No, it's been like this the whole time, but I put my head back and you can like see it. Like. Alright. Well, weird. you know what I'm thinking now? What? We wrap this puppy up. Okay. Play some Fortnite. <laughs> How's that sound? I like it. <laughs> you, you heard the man, all right? <laughs> we gotta so, play some Fortnite. Yeah, we gotta play Fortnite. So that's the end of this podcast. This is a this was a long one, fifty minutes and a half, fifty and a half Damn. minutes right here. Like so, yeah. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you want to see uh, another one, we got we got one other one. This is the second one, so that would mean we have one other one. But, and there's gonna be another one next wednesday so like and subscribe stay tuned yeah what hit the bell too though hit the notification bell and follow us on tiktok and instagram all right yeah links down below thanks for watching bye bye